In this video, I will show you how to combine your two separate mono tracks. So I've got this mono track number one and mono track number two into a single stereo track, whereas the first mono track sounds into your left channel, and then the second mono track is going to sound into the right stereo channel. So what you're gonna have to do now is go to the multi-track, create a stereo session, make sure that master is selected to stereo, it's a good idea to make sure that your sample rate and bit depth matches the ones that you had when you created the mono files. So you do that, you're gonna click the rightmost button onto your first track and insert the first mono track and do the same for the second mono track. So now what you're gonna have to do, you can either pull this line down or you can do the same thing here. Just uh, pull this one all the way to the right. and pull this one all the way to the left. You can do the vice versa, but it doesn't matter much. The difference between doing that here on a track, if, if you do it on the track and there's multiple clips, then it will be applied to all of those clips. If you do it here using this uh, panning line, this will be done only to this particular clip but you can do it like this as well. Now we're gonna select both of these tracks. You're gonna click the right mouse button and choose mix down session to new file. And you can choose either the selected clips or entire session. In my case, it doesn't matter because those two selected, selected clips are the entire session. For you, it may be different. And here you go, you're gonna have your two uh, mono clips, mono tracks merged into a single stereo track. So the first track will sound into one side of your channel and the second track will be audible in the second channel for you.